unfortunately YouTube took down the first episode of the series so if you haven't seen that yet check it out on our website the link will be in the description check it out before you watch this video and without further ado enjoy the episode good morning everybody we have just woken up the brain is not turning on yet I haven't slept like this in three days I think we're gonna leave soon three hour journey to the maze look at that Whew. Get ready to squeeze it. Oh, squeeze it. This is gonna be a very tight squeeze. It's gonna be a bumpy ride. <laughs> I don't think it's actually worse. Oh. <laughs> oh. What is it then? It's a the war is it the warning light? Maybe what about it? I don't know. It's like we just drive like this. Have you actually pulled up your handbrake? Ah. Obviously. Ah okay. Ah. <laughs> the there we go. <laughs> that was smart. Holy shit! That's a proper Italian town. So I think we're at the final town. Saying we're gonna be there in six minutes. It should be on the hill around the corner. Oh yeah, look. Labarinto. The arena. Oh, there we go. That's it. Yeah, yeah, that's it. First sight of the labyrinth. We have arrived. Yeah, I think we parked right here. Nice, Luke. Oh. We made it alive. Wow. Look at this. Woo. Did you know, historically, this is a structure of a vagina? <laughs> of a boom boom. Oh my god, look at this structure. Wow. That you have to enter through the pom pom region. Okay, are you ready? I'm about to be a new man. We have entered the labyrinth. I'm thinking it's your time. My time? It's your time to oh. become a real man. Oh. This is a special experience. Oh shit. Okay, are you ready? This is oh my god. I'll be waiting for you. Oh, oh looky. Oh shit. You feel a change, new man. And again. In and out. In and out, quick take, quick take. That's how the first time normally go, to be honest. <laughs> Drive three hours, quick take, gone. Let's go home. If you want a one minute man, goddamn Nasha man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm starting to think that this structure is really representing things that have happened to some of us recently. When you first discover the wonders of the female body, you can get really lost until you finally find your way back out. All right. So the spot is significantly better than I thought it would be. There's some serious gaps here. I thought it'd just be circles going down. Yeah, yeah. But right here is really nice. Can do some variation. Quite a tough spot. It's all jumps, very leggy. Oh! So far, the first challenge of the day. Standing free, plow out, skip a wall. Boom! Skip the middle wall, down to that wall. I can't tell how hard it is yet. I think here I can do it, chilling. There looks like I could bounce it, but I'm just gonna try it here first. Ah, that's kind of scary. Oh, no, no, you got it. A big jump, easy overshoot it. Oh, easy. Yes. Yeah, me a shot, you make it. What? Whoa, wow, that might be a thing. Yeah. Oh, my. God. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. Yeah, that's the challenge. But that's like park. a huge challenge. Because it's the same size as this one, but yeah. level. So I'm going to try the plow here where it's a bit more level. And if I make that upright, then I'll send the, the plow. Oh, I see it happening. You got the momentum. Yeah. You can definitely do that. Oh, Orlando. Blood clot. This man's jumps have gotten really big. Three, two, one. <sighs> 
Ah, oh, I'm committed yet. Fuck sake. Yeah, yeah I'll, I'll do one more prep. Oh. Yeah, I looked at it on the tape, but it looked good. That's it, G. You see the momentum, yeah? Just catch my breath before I go, but that one felt good because when I landed, I looked at it and it looked the speed coming towards yeah, it yeah. looked good. So. Are you committed so, in your brain on this one? Yeah, yeah, I yeah. think so, yeah. Yep. Ah. Ah. But I can see it's big. Oh, I think another thing that's kind of. Scary is you're like skipping loads of walls and they all look the same. Yeah. And when it's all the way back there and you're focusing on putting power here looking at that, it's kind of a lot for your brain to process. I think if you just did like a from here, one jump ply a splat, you'll feel better. Yeah, that's a good idea, I think. Remember, if you can splat something, then you should, it shouldn't be scary. But I'm scared of splatting, that's why it's scary. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so to break this one a bit easier, you're going to do standing pre plow, just like this one. Yeah. Combine. It's a good idea. Three, two, one. Oh, fuck's sake. You're going to be fine. I don't know why I'm so scared of it. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Maybe because you can't reach. Really save it and jump backwards. Yeah, see how it goes. It's a bit harder, I guess. Mm. Let's go, Alando. Three. Power! That's it. Yes, that's it, Orlando. That was a real power. I'm thinking you're ready for the real big one now. Big boy challenge. Hey. Yeah. Let's see how you do under pressure. Yes. Oh, I've yes. I've been this shit forever. I've been in the field. Yes. Whatever they throw at me, brush it off. Oh, Pick myself up, moving on to the battle. Okay. Hey. Yeah. Ain't no errors, baby. It's a new nice. era. I wake up early, feeling like I'm cash, I get to the paper, boy. Extra, extra. Fuck with me, you know that I got it. Come with me, let's take a trip to the islands. We up on the jet, we'll do more than just fly on it. Stand on that hill, you gon' die on it. Boom. Baby, I'm not one of them, you should try on it. Miss me with all that I'm on it and next. Yeah. Fuck this up, I send you back to your ex. But good luck with that, this is big as it gets. Hey, okay. let's see how you do under pressure. Yeah. Let's see how you do under pressure. Give them a name to remember. Okay. Shoot a whole clip, firepower in this coalition. We just turned the field yes. into a demolition. It was desolate, but I had premonition. I was training for war every exhibition, every extra mission, every enemy listening. Get off my dick, I got bad intentions. Make it right every wrong, and I'm back with a vengeance. I show you the ropes. Peace in my town, I can show you the coast. Up in the shots if they wanted to smoke. If you know, then you know. <laughs> Slippy. Lucas, from my experience, Aegis Pre is so easy to spot it. Yeah, it's been easier. It hits it every single time. Ever. Like, yeah, compared to side pre, it's a really much easier. Really? Yeah, man. And that, that, so it, basically, it will be fine. you send the power like a side pre, but eight twisted. <laughs> That's the, really the tra technique. So, so go the distance and do an eight twist. Is what you're saying, yeah? I run and I jump. I do an A twist. But you go this distance. But I go that distance and land yeah, on the wall. Yeah. I think I understand, but I'm not quite sure. Maybe we need to explain it. <laughs> yeah, man, me, I really see it in you, Lucas. I see it in me too. I've been doing it and I've been practicing landing. Can I go like that out of it? You just need Sorry. to visualize exactly how it's going to happen. It's the same as what I've been doing, so it's fine. I can't see what's going to go wrong, so I should just do it. Yeah. Fuck! Scary now that I actually have to do it. Ready? Let's go, Lucas. Yeah, ready. Got it, man. Fuck! I'm getting really close now, though, at least. Let's go, G. Oh, I know when I start running, I'm gonna go. I believe in him. Mm. It was a really scary, but the easy when you send it. I know it's got it. Yeah. Let's go, come on G.
Yes, yes, Lucas! Let's go, man, let's go! Oh, yes! You did so good! Oh. You did it so good! You see the ball so easy! Yes, bro! You did it so good! I think everyone have a good training. Yeah, I feel like we made the most of the spot with the time that we had. We yeah. left a little bit late. And I think, oh my God, it looks insane right now, Orlando. All right, so we're leaving the spot now. Thank you, Maze. You've been very good. Time to send it in the car. All right, the steep and bumpy roads have started. Oh, this road looks so sick. What? Oh. Yeah. What? Nah, you can't fit through. You can't fit through. What the? Oh fuck shit! Is oh no! To do reverse. It's always go up that. It's what? telling you to go forwards now. You get car or walking? Am I walking? No, I'm. Nah, you can only do driving away. Do you want me to get out and help you reverse? Nah. What do you think you're fine? <laughs> it's good we've done this in a day. So yeah, the maps right here was telling him to go right up these stairs. <laughs> or down there where the car can't fit. Okay, okay, okay. I, 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 bro, I see it. Yeah. Okay, good. But I need to go up, like, because if I turn... This is far. No, 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 wrong way. Okay, we have to go back up there. <laughs> this is fucked. Hold on. We need Aaron to deadlift your rear end and put it into... Sh okay, five of us. Can someone look in the back and I'll look in the front? So I'll front, oh, front, you're good. Okay, now you're about to roll onto the guy's porch. Yeah, a bit more, bit more, bit more. Bit more. Yeah. Go, go, go. Yeah, you're, you're yeah, smack good. bang precision right now. Mia touched the wall in me hand. Okay, the map has found a new direction for Luke. <laughs> he needs to go right up here. <laughs> onto the stairs. Mia thinking Waze isn't as good as it is in London, in Italy. <laughs> You thinking the same? Careful. Yeah, I think it's left up there. <laughs> go left now. Go left. Oh, <laughs> we survived that. We have survived without the collision. We don't lose the deposit. So we made it back to a real road. Oh, God. It's a night time now, but we're in a supermarket. We're starting to stock up for a long night climbing the volcano. So I think we need a lot of water. <laughs> We need some bread and all the basic essentials to survive uh, 24 hours. Okay, we're just back at Luca's now. You don't want to know what it smells like in here. But <laughs> on, other, on other words, we're all packing, making sure we have enough clothes and enough camping gear to survive a really cold night. Just use trousers all summer. You can see my leg, you can hear the smell. Oh uh, yeah. And one pair of socks. How about others? The only thing I'm a bit concerned about, I know there's a lot of snow. You just have to and I have a little hole in my shoe. And I think freezing climber with a wet feet might equal frostbite. Alando, you have any mmms for the audience? Mmm. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are leaving the comfort of Luca's house. About to set off into the wilderness. Actually, I feel like I'm forgetting something for sure. Alright. Tent poles. Tent. Tent. Sleeping bag. Sleeping bag. What a mattress. Mattress. Insulated Ooh. floor. Clothes. <laughs> Three pairs of socks. Three. Yeah, I got jumper shorts. Yeah, just in case my feet get webs. Wet wipes. Satisfying little blanket. Ah, uh, the victim blanket. Victim, victim blanket. blanket. <laughs> It's going to be really cold tonight. We looked online and said it's going to feel like minus 14 degrees, which is the coldest climate I've ever experienced. So hopefully it's going to be okay. Okay, so we're on like the edge of Mount Etna now, driving up and up, and I'm feeling really spooky vibe, I can't lie. This area is spooky. <laughs> That is fucked. <laughs> yeah, over there. So I've done a in Orlando I'm looking at what the volcano actually looks like when it erupts. I don't know why they didn't look at it before. No, it's there. It's there. We think it's there. Temperature drops like 
15 degrees now, it's really cold. We've got all the layers on, and I think we're just gonna hike up until we can't hike no more, basically, mm -hmm. and then set up a camp. That's the one on Maps, G. This is the. Okay, it's probably main. that one. Uh, oh, that yeah. one is the one on Maps. Yeah. yeah. Oh, more like an ice. It's not yellow, it's good. It's good? Tasty snow? Fresh, yeah, really fresh. Just enter the snow range, do you know what I mean? Yeah. I feel like boom! Snow range now. Feels good. Fuck me sleeping. <laughs> Fuck me a complete sleeping. What? <laughs> Did a slip in the Reebok, in the Ollos. Look at this. I can't even slide down the thing if I want to. Exactly. Nothing. This is fit for parkour right now, like you could jump to this. Yeah. Like, this is side pre, pre, uh, pre too. Side pre territory? Yeah. yeah. Yowza. So, Olos are not only waterproof in terms of slip, you don't even need crampons because they grip your nice. This shoe is OP. Like all conditions gear, right? Yeah. Here. Olo code right here. This is the but. real ACG shoe. Are they actually slipping off? Yeah, like I have to be like. I think it's foot as well, you know. It feels like climbing, like my right foot is slipping over. Look at this, Abdullah. I can just stand on the ice. <laughs> nice one, Luca. Finished setting up our camp. That was so hard because of the wind and the cold fingers, but we finally done it after some difficulty. Oh, Luca, Luca, and Orlando in the big tent. We got me and Abdullah in the technical beast. The penthouse. We got, that's the penthouse, yeah. Then we got Devin and Lucas <laughs> in the shack. They're still <laughs> setting up their shack, <laughs> making steady progress. The cavemen. <laughs> Look at that, using a rack. This is the shanty town. <laughs> this is the villa. This is the mansion. All right. Let's get eating. Good night, yeah. everyone. We probably won't see you again. Yeah, probably Unless not. Unless you come out and say, hey! All right, so I just got woken up, being told that we need to leave right now. Lucas is 10, is everything inside is completely wet. So, when stuff gets wet, the heat goes. Man, yeah, thinking, hopefully this is not wet. If this is wet, me is fucked. Oh no, my jacket's completely wet. <laughs> me and army gonna go, bro. It snowed a lot more than we expected, and mine and Lucas's shoes are completely under the snow right now. This is not good. I don't know how I'm gonna get down without my feet dying. Oh. So, we're just gonna start packing down all the tents. Luke's tent is, Lucas's tent is fucked, so everything's getting wet, so we need to leave very, very soon. Woo! It's a bit chilly out here. Oh, holy, hello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. Alright, so right now I'm in my warmest of hair because my jacket is completely wet. We managed to take down all the tents, but it's taken, uh, it's taken quite long. My hands are completely wet now and my feet, so I want to get going immediately so I can increase my body heat. Oh, <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> oh shit, the snow is deep now, fucking hell. Look at this! Oh my god. Porco Dio! Never in my life have I experienced this before. Just walking on a snowy mountain. So beautiful, it's insane. Oh, I love this! We love this. I'm trying to go quite quick so my body can get really hot and warm up because I am a bit worried that I'm completely freezing in my 
hands, feet, and body right now. Ah, ah. Find a little cabin that we're in here. Yeah. Oh my god. Your hands okay, yeah. no! Alright, it's the final stretch. We're about halfway down now. Took a little break in that cabin. But it didn't really help. It was just flat and full. No, no, your back's completely covered in snow. Ready? Yeah. Oh look, you can see the snow stop exactly where know, it stopped snowing yeah. yesterday. Yeah. That's sick. All right, so we've just made it back to the car. I stopped filming because it was starting to get quite fucked. I've taken off all my clothes now and I'm just trying to, huh, trying to dry. I'm completely wet. Me would really appreciate the dog clothes, man. Oh my fucking trousers are so <laughs> Bro, this is the only way right now. <laughs> naked. Oh my God. Bro, why is it not getting hot though? Uh, I think it's to pop the engine on. Yeah, do a little burn, Luki, a little burning. Please, hot, hot, please. A little burning. How are you feeling? Cold. Yeah. yeah. I do not want to drive right now. It's so warm somehow. What did you guys do to get warm? Be unprepared. <sighs> Alright, so now we're finally driving off the volcano. Oh my god, look how beautiful it looks. She's looking in her prime right now. That was a night to remember for life, 100%. You're gonna forget that? No, that was amazing. <laughs> that was one of those moments you know, especially in the moment. Yeah, I loved awesome. every second of it, except getting down. Hey, Klaus is getting out. He's got his important belongings. <laughs> <laughs> Phone my, and passport. In my pocket. <laughs> feeling so happy that we're in a warmer climate now, but I'm feeling the consequences of getting wet on the mountain. I put a victim blanket in my socks, and now it's just, completely like puddles on my feet oh oh god that's more that's like pure water the edge of my sock oh god yeah yeah oh oh my god i think that's sweat oh that smells fucked we're basically gonna go to luca's yard now leave our wet like sleeping bags and stuff so they can dry during the day because i think it's gonna be a problem if it will have wet stuff, so take with them. Okay guys, so we're at a spot in Catania. Luca took us here. Apparently it's one of the main spots around here. And I think the lads are warming up. Puddle plot. We might as well do all three. All three, all three, all three! Yeah! Alana's got some serious leg power. Ooh, fuck. Oh, so easy now. Yes, sir. Nice. Mm. Yes, that was nice. Yes. Nice, easy. Just like that pin. Yeah. All right, so just here, I saw a little gap that I can do. It's a running pre, it's also a possible dive kong, but a bit big. From here, right there. Oof, let's take a look at that. That is a nice running pre. It's pretty scary, it's about a bit, bit bigger than IMAX running pre over scary drop. Yeah, I'm ready. I just want to get my run up, right? I'm just scared that it's going to get dark. Yeah, I mean, you're chilling right now. Yeah. Yep. Nice. Easy. Quick commitment. Fucking hell. Beautiful. Well done, sir. Oh, that was nice. Nice one, man. All right, so uh, speeding through every challenge at the spot because the light is going against us, and we still have more things that we want to do. Alana wants to pop out this nice side pre. Been a while since I've seen one of these yeah, from been you. Been a while, so this is a nice one to get back into it. Oh, holy Messiah. It's starting to get dark now, but we've got one more challenge that Lucas wants to hit. He's looking pretty good on his prep, so. Have to do it before it gets really dark. It's starting to really get dark. Yeah, yeah, I know. How about now? 
Yeah. Yeah. Easy. easy. So easy, man. That's really good. That's sick. Oh. Whoa. That was fresh. Wow. Wow. All right, so at the start of the trip, Devon came across this lovely little post slide as we were driving past. And he really wanted to do it. Yeah, Have stop, you? stop, stop. I think it would, it will wobble like this. Does the, do the bricks move around the bottom? No. For sure, yeah? What do you think? Nice little pole slide? Yeah, it's scary, scary to see. Are you going to do it as well? Huh? Are you going to do it as well? Not today, I didn't bring my stuff for it. Well, your pole slide goes. Yeah, yeah. My outfit. It's probably the scariest one I've done so far. Really? Because the pole is at the highest point of this ledge. So I'm hitting the, the pole at the very top. Yeah, yeah. So this pole's longer than other ones I've done that are at the top of the pole. So I have to really commit to dropping straight down. Yeah. I have to undershoot it, which I find really scary, but it's the safest way to do it, I think. Yeah. The one at the very end, because that one ends in the bush anyway. So this one's clean, but it's definitely the scariest one. All right, I don't want to look at it too long. I think I've got to go. All right. Just breathe and yep. straight down. And Chocolate safe, chocolate perfect, straight down. Over there. Oh, yes. Wow! Fucking nice. Oh, oh. That was your best pull side yet. You really set the drop into that. Jesus Christ. How was that, Devon? You happy with that pole slide? Really, really happy, actually. Well, it's the best one I've done so far. I think, I think that's by far your best one. Yeah, I really that's... commit to the dropping down. Yeah, it was so yeah. nice. Just before it went, Luca like said, just like take a deep breath and drop straight down. And I did exactly yeah. what he said. It was so good. So now that was the final send of Catania. We're going to go get some food, get on the bus and make our way to mainland Italy, Bari. Yo. Yo. Alright, so we just got off the bus at Barry. Seven in the morning. I'm completely teleported. And it was a very pleasurable experience for me. It's colder. Yeah. What's wrong with your knee? When I straighten my leg, it's just sharp pain my in my knees. Really? Yeah. Why? I don't even know. I think well my hypothesis. Before the coach, I was feeling really fine. After the coach, I'm feeling really fucked. <laughs> So we're just chilling at McDonald's. Yeah, so Devin just called us saying that he needs help and apparently he's locked himself in the laundry place. And he sent us the location and we need to go rescue him from the laundry place. He says that he really needs a piss. <laughs> <laughs> he says I might, he was like, Luke, Luke, you have to come, like, you have to, might have to kick down the door, like, you sound so stressed. <laughs> Fuck sakes. All right, I've got one out in <laughs> what did he say? He was like, apparently there was a cardboard propping up the door, yeah. and then the person like that left before him, they moved it and just shut the door. And he was like, it's fucked, it's fucked. I think you have to break the window and open the door. <laughs> what, do you, what do you mean you found a way out? How do you find a way out if you're locked in? There was a button on the wall. <laughs> what the fuck? All right, we come back to McDonald's. See you in a bit. After all of that stress you went through, there was just a button on the side that you could have pressed to open the door the entire time. Take you, guy. It's like traveling with a kid. No, I was seven. He was getting best stressed. He was like, oh, don't don't worry. There was a button. There was a button on the wall that you could have just pressed the whole time. I'm glad you found it. Yeah. Alright, we've just heard the material, as you can see, it looks insanely good. The only issue is, the weather's really bad, so we're completely unable to do anything today. But, I think we're going to explore the city a little bit, see what spots we can find and anything like that. Get a really good night's sleep, and then go hard tomorrow. So yeah, I'm excited. It looks good. And there's literally just spots everywhere that I can see. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, little gaps and challenges. That's the end. Yeah. 
But yeah, it looks really good. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Oh.